I am 30 miles outside of Santa Fe, New Mexico, and it kind of feels like the middle of nowhere. But currently, it is the home to Hollywood's newest heartthrob, the man who is being turned into the ancient god of thunder, Thor. So what's it like being Thor? Uh, it's pretty exciting, you know? The whole thing is so surreal. It's been really fun. Yeah. You're awesome. You're so cool. Tell us about the chemistry between you two. Well, I think there's a lot of um, chemistry, and um, along the way, they're like, hey, you're not so bad. <laughs> I actually kind of like you. <laughs> he has other love interests, too. He's like, you know. Wow. Don't he's a god. <laughs> <laughs> he has a big appetite. <laughs> you know, just a minute ago, Ken was talking about your great rhythm and timing in this, you know, like in being Thor. Do you think it has anything to do with being in Dancing with the Stars? <laughs> Absolutely. I credit every bit of whatever talent in any field to Dancing with the Stars. It's, uh... Were you in Dancing with the Stars? No. What? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I didn't know Australia. that. I That's we, so cool. I thought we talked about this. No, we didn't. In London. No, I got you. Wait, the American one? No, the Australian one. The Australian, Australian. Australian Yeah, it's much more uh, prestigious in Australia. I have been using. What about my pirouette? That's true. He doesn't really find pirouette. Did you notice the rhythm? The, the shoulders back? The, the yeah. Posture. He's, posture. He's, Natalie just did a ballet film. What do you think of mine? I think ballet? I think you've got the moves. I think you could really um, you could really make it. Cool. Yeah. Have you ever seen her rap? Yes, I have. It's incredible. Huh? It's incredible. Three million views on YouTube. It's incredible. It's amazing. It's the first thing I saw. Thanks, guys. Awesome. One time occurrence. Action. Over here! Do you feel pressure because how well these franchises have done? Iron Man blowing up, Spider-Man. Yeah. You, I mean, you're the next guy in line. Do you feel that pressure? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's. I think you feel, uh, yeah, as an active pressure in kind of any film to make it work. But with, you know, something like Marvel Studios, and it comes with the history of not only the films have been a great success, but, you know, years of of comic books, you know, and stories that have been written and fans that have been reading the stuff for, you know, many years. Um, you know, so, so absolutely, but there's, you have people like Kenneth Branagh and Anthony Hopkins and, you know, even the, the, the producers, you know, people like Craig Kyle who um, has written comic books over the years and still does and mm -hmm. knows more about the Marvel Universe than, you know, most people have met and, um, you know, he's on set with us all the time giving advice and, um, and the writer Don Payne is the same sort of thing. So you do have a, a huge team of support there and we're all in the same boat, you know, mm -hmm. um, we're wanting it to work. So. Chris is a big boy now. He sure is, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, he took seriously the challenge that had to be taken on by whoever was gonna play Thor to, to uh, find this combination we wanted of a sort of Herculean strength and gosh he's, he's strong we, we had him doing all sorts of uh, physical feats on it um, and some of them just practical lifting people up lifting two people up uh, doing it for a long time over the course of a day um, and it's uh, we were talking about uh, <laughs> I, I sort of said you know, I said, oh, we could, you know, we've got to do this, and you got to get your shirt off. And they said, do you mind doing this? He said, don't I mind? He said, I've spent six months getting into shape for this. Said, no, I don't mind. Is it crazy how big he is? It's, <laughs> it's disgusting. Chris, you're big. <laughs> I care, babe. Yes. Yeah, it's going to be like, Chris and that little midget girl. <laughs> Starring in Thor. <laughs> <laughs>